Yes, this will be close enough, I think. Are you prepared? No one is more surprised than I. They are willing to sacrifice themselves to save the world, yet they will never hear a single word of thanks. A funny thing for a selfish man to say, isn't it? I'd better be careful not to learn anything from this. I've no idea. Speak to them. Let their own words convince you. But once the choice is made, there is no turning back. The harvest of a fresh soul will no doubt bring Molag Baal's attention upon us. You must take that opportunity to strike him down. We've already been over this. You need an infusion of divine power to... I've no idea. We've already been over this. You need an infusion of divine power to even consider challenging a Daedric Prince. The Amulet of Kings can give you that power, but at the cost of a life. The Amulet of Kings is a relic of Akatosh, the Dragon God of Time. His powers embody the qualities of perseverance and invincibility, while promoting the virtues of duty, service and obedience. Make of that what you will. Remember Vestige. We fight for our people. We fight for Tamriel. Evil might be kept at bay for a time, but it can never be completely eradicated. What is important is that we resist it, that we fight on and keep fighting. Very little. The scrolls can see many things, even possible futures, but they are not infallible, and they will not make this choice for you. You cannot cross the sea simply by standing and considering the water. Be strong, Vestige, and act. There is no such thing as a safe choice. There are only other choices. Oblivion did not make me a monster. It just confirmed my own worst fears about myself. It would be fitting and honorable if you were to choose me. It would be a fine death. Position yourself over there, Vestige, and brace yourself. We'll never forget you, sire. Or your sacrifice. Great Akatosh, Dragon God of Time, forgive me for my hubris. Grant your divine power to the Vestige, and restore your protection to Tamriel that my sacrifice might not be in vain. History may not remember your sacrifice, but those present here will never forget it. Divines of Tamriel, with this vessel of your power, the Amulet of Kings, I call upon your strength. Let this noble sacrifice be a testament to our desire to set things right and restore balance to the Mundus. Your champion stands ready. Accept this offering and imbue this vestige with your glory. Let the will of Molag Baal be denied. Vestige, now is the time. You must ascend the path and face the Daedric Prince. You must face the God of Schemes alone. I will get the others to safety. Go! Continued meddling has reached an end, hero of Tamriel. What is this foolishness? Has your tiny mortal mind snapped? Do you really think you can defeat me? The dark machinations of oblivion are far more complex than anything your mortal senses can comprehend. Your anguish.
wish will be legendary, even in oblivion. Fight on? Do you care nothing for your own existence? God of Oblivion, you are less than nothing. Adric Trinket can't defeat me. I am Molag Bar, Lord of Domination. What is this, infant? Do you think your toy can slay a god? Seeds of eternal torment. Camriel is ripe, and I have all of eternity. Come forward, Vestige. You are safe for now. 
Something precious to you has been riven from Stonefire's being. I have brought it here for you to reclaim. I congratulate you, little insect. Your sting is formidable. You have bested me and released a thousand times a thousand souls back into the Mundus. For the moment, your world is spared. But my grand scheme has only begun to unfold. Excellent. Your power shall prove useful in the coming conflicts. You've made a great and terrible enemy this day. Your world would have been better off if the plain meld had succeeded. Had you bowed before me and accepted eternal servitude, I would have protected you. There are worse masters than I. Far worse. You are but a phantom here in my domain, Stonefire. The mortal prophecies of the scrolls have been fulfilled. Leave this place and return to your pet. You have a powerful ally. Did you know that she would bring you here? What future role has she to play in this grand cosmic farce, I wonder? Yeah. Your meddling has already cost me too much. A cursed creature of light and flame. This farce no longer amuses me. Your soul is restored. I can see its light within you. And you have saved your world from a great calamity. But know this, mortal. The forces of Oblivion are legion, and the God of Schemes is but a single player in a complex battle for supremacy. You have wounded him gravely. It will be some time before his power is restored. As your enemy fell, the one you call Abner Tharn took Chim El Adabal and fled. He returns to the land from whence he came, the place you call Cyrodiil. The amulet's power has been expended for a generation or more. The Imperial will not be able to use it, nor will he profit from it, though he will spend many frustrated years in the attempt. The tear in the veil between Oblivion and Nern has been repaired. Your world is safe for now. Gone forever. But their memory remains. I can see the light burning brightly behind your eyes. Your friend is a part of you now, just as the strength of the Divines burns like a flame within your renewed soul. Your story has only begun. Molag Ball still has plans for you. In many ways, these events played out to his advantage. And you have attracted the attention of the other Daedric Princes as well. The war between mortal kingdoms is still ravaging your world, but your true enemies are not mortal. If you are to be prepared for the coming conflicts, you must fully comprehend what is at stake. You must live among those you make war upon. Indeed. When you return to Tamriel, go to the place you call the Harborage. My gift awaits you there. It will allow you to travel to other lands and hide your true nature from those who would see you as a foe. I have no more desire to keep you here than you had to remain in Cold Harbor. I shall return you to your little den in the wild. Your surviving companions await you there. Are you prepared to leave? <laughs>